Today in Growing STEM, we are going behind the theater curtain. The Jackson School for the Arts in Massillon is working on their latest production, the musical Mary Poppins. The cast and crew share the science and secrets within the onstage magic. The umbrella, the carpet bag, and the gentle way she floats to the stage, it is the iconic character, Mary Poppins. Jackson High School and elementary students have been rehearsing for weeks to put on the musical but flying is something new. I think that the first time I went up, it was a little tricky because I was mostly concerned of, oh, I'm not on the ground anymore and wasn't worried about um, anything Mary Poppins related. But now as I'm practicing more and more, I get to bring in elements of the character to the flight. All right, going up in three, two, one, go. Parker Seaman, who plays Bert the chimney sweep, is also learning to fly, getting used to the wires and harness that allow him to perform upside down. It's kind of like out of body. Like you're like, am I actually doing this? And then one minute you're up in the air and the next you're down. It's really a new experience. And I guess that's physics for you. <laughs> He's not wrong. I thought I'd just explain to you a little bit of the basics behind what's actually happening science-wise, physics-wise with a pulley system. During rehearsal, a physics class stops by for a look at how the ropes and pulley system works. So I'm getting what's called a mechanical advantage. It's letting me pull a lot more distance of rope, but not need to use as much force. To ensure all flying cast members do so safely, the school hired the company on the fly and local stagehands to assist the students who will lift their classmates above the stage. We are very comfortable in putting their hands on this technology and they're doing a great job learning it. Like knowing how the machine works really helps with like your ability to be able to get it down and be able to do it constantly from time to time. And once you get that down, it's basically a walk in the park or I guess a walk on the ceiling. That's not the only on stage magic. To create a breakaway vase, the director turned to the engineering class who 3D printed the prop. Made in four pieces, it's held together with magnets. <laughs> With opening night quickly approaching, it's the combination of science and art that is the true magic. Being able to mold those together and, and make something an educational experience as well as a performance to the community is a big deal to us. All right, I know what you're asking. How can I get tickets? Well, if you would like <laughs> to see the production of Mary Poppins, you haven't missed it. The show runs November 7th, 9th, and 10th at the Jackson Center for the Performing Arts. We have a link to ticket information on our website, wkyc.com. Isn't that cool? I mean, Very. people always go to the theater. They see these amazing productions, and you don't really think beyond that too much. Like, hmm, I wonder how they do that. But I was really stymied by the 3D printed vase. Uh, that's my favorite part. Yeah, it was really Held neat. together by magnets. It breaks this exactly the same way every time. Yeah. Pretty cool. Yep.